Hi, Jonathan Carbuti here, and welcome back to our agent training blog where we bring you relevant information to make more sales and have 2017 be one of your best years yet. Today I want to talk about REO properties and kind of have the newer agents and even the experienced agents think about adding different types of business to your portfolio and specializing in real estate. This house here at 133 Highland Park Road in North Haven is actually an REO property. And it's actually not the picture that most agents have of an REO property. It's a gorgeous custom 2200 square foot, four bedroom, three and a half bath ranch priced in the 350s. And most likely it'll sell somewhere in the low threes. This is an example of the type of properties and the type of REO business that a lot of the newer agents and experienced agents should be going after. A lot of agents tend to think negatively about the REO industry as a whole or have apprehensions about getting into the REO industry or listing these properties. But I'm here to tell you that you're leaving a lot of money on the table because these properties attract a lot of investors. They attract a lot of first time home buyers who think the property may be right for them. And then you ultimately wind up selling them something else. And what it also does is it attracts a lot of curious neighbors and you're able to start those conversations and you start those relationships in the neighborhood. This is a perfect example of you as the real estate agent being able to control the saleable inventory in the marketplace and also control the buyers and other potential sellers as well. I just want to thank you guys for watching our video today on REO properties and getting into the REO industry. And if you guys have any questions at all about getting in the REO industry, I've been doing it for years, call me at the number at the bottom of the screen or shoot me a quick email. I'd be happy to sit down and talk with you and find out if it's right for you. Thanks for watching.